this is my biggest unboxing ever from thecubicle.com. So these are six puzzles that I've always worn. You've probably seen these, but let's just go through them. This is a cheeky 2x2x3 two by two by in white. This is a Dino Cube. Um, this is a 2x2 two two Time Machine. This is a 2x2 two two Mirror Blocks. This is a Penrose Cube, and this is a Mini Cube. So let's go ahead and get started with a 2x2x3. Two by two by so this is a puzzle that I actually popped, and I actually never got a new one because I tried fixing it. It fixed, but then it broke again. So here it is. It's in. It's actually in white because I thought it looked cool, and it actually really does. We have white on white instead of black, which is something I was anticipating. So this actually turns really well. It's got a nice little like uh, sandy feeling to it, but it's also extremely smooth. So yeah, I kind of know all of this. I know how to solve it. I know kind of the concepts because I, I had one before a long time ago, and I'm extremely happy to have another one. So, just turning here, it feels really nice to try the middle layer, because that's kind of essential for cuboids like this. Yeah, so really nice, kind of fun little cuboid. So now, let's move on to, gosh, there's so many puzzles. Which one? I, I think I'm going to move on to the mini cube next. So this is my first mini cube. I've been wanting a mini cube for so long, so let's check it out. Looks like we've got a keychain with it, so you can keychain this on. But the keychain is removable, if you prefer it that way. Um, how are you supposed to remove the keychain on this? There we go. So this is the Chi Mini Pillowed Cube, I believe. And this is a very nice cube. I believe it's 55 millimeters, maybe? It's all in Chinese, I can't understand it. But, yep, this is a very cool little mini puzzle, and I've been wanting one of these for quite a long time. My only complaint is that there's this little bump here that where the keychain hooks onto, which is not my preference, but that's fine. It's got some standard stickerless internals. I'm pretty sure, let's just check something. Can you adjust the tensions on this? Yes. Yep, just a basic screwed spring, as you'd expect with a cheeky puzzle. So, I'm pretty sure this is modified. This is a, um, based on a Warrior W mechanism. I can't take a piece out because it's too tight right now. But let's just check corner cutting. Um, I'll go that far and reverse. Ooh, it actually does pretty good. So this is the Chigi Mini Keychain. So let's go ahead and scramble up and see what it looks like all scrambled. Um, okay, there's the scrambled Chigi Mini Pillow Keychain. Okay, so after those, now let's get into, hmm, let's do the 2x2 two two mirror blocks next. So I recently got the 3x3 three three mirror blocks, and I've been looking to expand my mirror blocks collection. So the next obvious choice would be the 2x2. Two two. There is a 4x4 four four and 5x5 five five on Twisty Text, but I wasn't intending on getting those because they're probably pretty hard to get, and they'd be way too hard. So this is the 2x2 two two mirror blocks. Turns just as good as the 3x3 three three mirror blocks. Let's just check something for a second. What's the mechanism in here? Seems like a chi chi d 2x2. Turning is very smooth and sandy, and what you'd expect from a 2x2 two two mirror blocks. So let's go ahead and scramble this up and see how it looks all scrambled. Well, this is the 2x2 two two mirror blocks all scrambled. This actually looks pretty cool. So now let's go ahead and do a quick solve, maybe? Let's see here. So this corner is right. Okay, so we got our first layer. Okay, so it looks like um, it's a corner twist. Now I'm not extremely familiar with um, these kinds of puzzles, but I kind of try my best. Um, let's see, is this right? Yep. And then we have this here, so I think if we just swap these. What? Some sort of parody? Well, I did not know that there could be parody on this. Let's try one more thing. Well, looks like I have some sort of a single twisted corner. Um, I'm noticing the brush strokes here that this... Something is not aligned here. Do we have to swap these pieces? Well, I'll have to look at that layer, but for now I'm stumped. 
So let's move on to the Dino Cube. Alright, so this is a puzzle that I've been wanting maybe for the longest time out of all of these. And this is a pretty simple corner turning puzzle that just kind of turns like this. And what's cool about it is that you can turn these two sides and they don't affect each other. So if I do this, these sides actually don't affect each other when you're turning. So turning is pretty good. I wouldn't say as good as the others. But I think it should be a pretty simple puzzle to solve. But there might be some sort of um, swapping or parity case that I don't really know about. Alright, next, um, the Penrose Cube. So this is a cube that I've been interested in for a while, and... What? Well, looks like they got some double packaging going over here. Not sure exactly why it's necessary, but here it is. So the Penrose Cube, if you don't know already, is a cube with um, three colors on it. So you have blue, red, and yellow on this one. And basically what it does is, since two, since all the, since pairs of these sides are kind of barreled together, it actually involves some shape-shifting like that. Not a lot of shape-shifting, but just enough to be a fun little challenge to solve, and I'll probably be solving this cube soon. Okay. Next is the grand finale. This is the one that I've been really wanting. This is the Leafun 2x2 Time Machine. So this, my friends, is an extremely amazing puzzle. So basically what this is, is it's a 2x2. It's a two two. It turns and solves exactly like a 2x2. Two two. But there's these weird dial things that allow you to swap around pieces. Now this one doesn't turn super amazing. It's cheap. But you can swap around all these pieces. So it adds a little bit more complexity to the 2x2 two two solve. I don't imagine this to be super hard, but there might be some parity at the end. Well, I guess that's it, right? Because we have six puzzles unboxed. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we have the Chi 2x2x3. Two two Chi, um, this little mini cube thing. Chi 2x2 two two mirror blocks. Um, Leaf on Penrose Cube, Leaf on 2 with your Time Machine, and chi -E Dino Cube. So, this, I've really appreciated this unboxing. It's a great addition to my cube collection, puzzles that I've always wanted, and there's going to be a part two coming soon. So, I um, will link the links to buy the cubes in the description if you're interested in any of them, and I'll see you next time.